Hey all, Lost Sandman R35 coming at you from Two Guys Reviews, and this is Zombie Talk! Uh, welcome back, you zombie crackheads, you. Uh, today I'm going to discuss uh, what the possibilities are, or speculation is, regarding the second DLC that is forthcoming from Activision and Treyarch and zombies. So, uh... Let's start talking. Uh, probably the main thing I keep hearing is Paris. Paris, 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 Paris. Uh, which automatically makes me suspect that it's not going to be Paris. I know there's a tower in Paris, and we've been to North America and China, so, you know, Europe is the logical next step. But I completely disagree with that, so I'm going to go uh, and... Uh, I'll tell you what my theory is, and my theory is, is that because everything is so hush-hush regarding what's coming up right now, I would actually have to say that most likely, and again, this is pure speculation, uh, there's no concrete evidence of anything right now, but because everything is so hush-hush, I think they're planning something special, uh, something pretty badass, and uh, that is in my opinion, could very well be Call of the Dead 2, or whatever they're going to call it. Uh, so that's a possibility, another George Romero type of uh, map. Uh, another thing uh, that I am have heard from actually another YouTuber out there, and I'm sorry, I can't remember his name right now, but it was such a solid speculation that he was giving and the reasons behind it that I had to, to say something about it, and that is... On the die rise loading screen, there's that little picture off to the left that kind of looks like a, I don't know, something in the underground or uh, something, uh, I don't know, it looks like it's definitely underground, something going on, who knows what it is, but uh, what he's saying is uh, it could very well possibly be the London Underground, which would be completely awesome in my opinion because the uh, if if those of you who don't know the london underground is very expansive uh there's not only subway tracks but there's like old decommissioned uh steam rail steam locomotive rail tracks um there's old subway tracks that aren't used anymore there's world war ii bunkers down there all kinds of stuff uh so that would actually be a pretty badass map in my opinion as well um Another bit of speculation is, uh, you know, uh, or not speculation, but things that I want to see from zombies. And uh, I know that I've said in the past, you know, Die Rai sucks. Uh, a lot of that had to do with the fact that there was that uh, glitch in the broken elevator, uh, which you're going to see uh, in just a second here. Uh, but they did patch it finally. It took them a while. It took them like a month or two to finally fix that damn thing. It seemed like forever. Um, but, uh, yeah, they, they finally fixed it. So I don't think Die Rise really sucks anymore. As a matter of fact, I will give props. And we were just talking about this last night. Uh, a bunch of friends I was playing with zombies. And we were talking about how well they planned out this map. And how, how ridiculously designed it was in other words it was it, they did a really good job and um oh by the way in the background uh you saw i just went down there on um 33 and i got myself back up to 34 i went to 36 uh it's not my high round my high round's 46 uh so it was a decent match i, I literally just played this so uh yeah that's what you're seeing right now in the background but uh, regarding uh, some of the things I want to see from zombies, I, the one thing that we were also talking about last night was a zombie rain map. Um, not like transit where there's just thunder and lightning, but like a full-on rainstorm. Um, that's something we haven't quite seen yet. And uh, that's uh, that would be something I would be all looking forward to as well. Uh, again, if it's in London, there you go. Rain in London. You... you, you Gotta love it, but uh, the, the beauty behind the thinking of that. And um, what else can we see in zombies? How about like a true 
snow map. I know we had Call of the Dead, and that was like ice and fog and sort of flurries, but it wasn't like a full-on blizzard. Or um, even something like, you know, uh, something to do with the environment is what I'm looking for, like a, like a hurricane or a... Um, Oh, uh, I don't know, near, oh, uh, well, they, everyone, they already did the fire, but, you know, near a volcano would be awesome. Um, uh, you know, something, something going on with the environment, you know, whether it be, oh, uh, how about, uh, just thought of this right as I was saying that, uh, it could be like, there could be like a tornado coming through. Who knows? Who knows what kind of craziness that they're planning? Again, I'm just you know rambling on here, uh, thinking about uh, what what they could possibly do. Uh, but uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, leave a comment and you know let me know what you want to see in the next zombie map. Uh, I'm certainly looking forward to it because as you can see, we're you know we we've. we've We've done Dire Eyes, we've been there, we've done that, we've done the Easter Egg, we are getting into the, you know, the 20s, the 30s, the 40s, uh, the 50s, I haven't gotten to the 50s quite yet, I'm almost there, uh, and so on and so forth, people are getting way, way high rounds now on Dire Eyes, so we're looking for a nice fresh map to start off on, and uh, just uh, let me know what you think, and uh, subscribe, and like if you can, um, Liking any of our videos really helps us out. It digs our our videos out of the YouTube wasteland, which sometimes they get stuck in. So uh, with that in mind, this is Lost Sandman R35 saying he's out.